Welcome to Auto Bike Focus, the channel where we dive into the machines that define engineering excellence, futuristic innovation, and raw performance. Today, our attention turns toward one of the most ambitious fighter jet projects in modern aviation history, the 2026 Mikoyan MiG-41, often described as the successor to the legendary MiG-31 Foxhound. The MiG-41 represents Russia's attempt to leap beyond fifth-generation technology into the realm of what many call the first sixth-generation interceptor. The project embodies speed, stealth, and long-range lethality, designed not only to dominate the skies, but also to operate in environments where conventional fighters cannot survive. In this script, we'll explore the MiG-41's design, capabilities, development background, operational role, and its place in the ever-evolving balance of global air power. The legacy of the MiG-31. Before the MiG-41, there was the MiG-31, an aircraft designed during the Cold War to intercept high-speed American bombers and reconnaissance planes. The MiG-31 was capable of flying at speeds above Mach 2.8 and operating at extremely high altitudes, ensuring Soviet airspace remained protected. However, by the 21st century, the MiG-31, though modernized, was aging, and Russia sought a replacement that could not only meet but exceed its predecessor's capabilities. The answer to this challenge was the MiG-41, envisioned as a platform that could maintain Russia's edge in high-speed intercept operations against next-generation threats. Development and Vision The MiG-41 project, also known as the PAC-DP, Prospective Aviation Complex for Long-Range Interception, was initiated to create a fighter that could surpass both Western fifth-generation jets and advanced hypersonic threats. The vision for the MiG-41 was ambitious, an aircraft capable of flying at Mach 4 or even Mach 5 with stealth features, advanced sensors, and the ability to intercept hypersonic missiles and aircraft. Unlike most modern fighters designed primarily for multi-role missions, the MiG-41 was conceived with a specialized focus, long-range interception at extreme speeds. By 2026, this jet had become the centerpiece of discussions about Russia's future air combat capabilities, airframe, and stealth design. The design of the MiG-41 fighter jet incorporates elements of stealth and aerodynamic efficiency, while its predecessor, the MiG-31, emphasize raw speed and altitude, the MiG-41 adds stealth shaping to reduce radar visibility. Its airframe reportedly makes use of advanced composite materials and radar-absorbing coatings to minimize detection while retaining the durability required for hypersonic flight. The sharp lines, blended fuselage, and possible tailless design reflect sixth-generation aesthetics, ensuring the jet is harder to detect and more survivable in modern contested airspace. The aircraft's structure must also withstand the extreme thermal stress produced at hypersonic speeds, pushing material science to its limits. Pulsion and performance. At the heart of the MiG-41's capability is its next-generation propulsion system. Russian engineers are believed to be developing a hybrid engine capable of operating efficiently at subsonic, supersonic, and hypersonic speeds. Reports suggest that the MiG-41 could cruise at speeds of Mach 4 and potentially achieve bursts approaching Mach 5. Such performance would make it the fastest operational manned fighter jet in the world. The aircraft would also operate at altitudes exceeding 20 kilometers, potentially near space, allowing it to detect and engage threats that conventional jets cannot. With such performance, the MiG-41 is not just a fighter, it is a strategic asset capable of controlling vast airspace. Avionics and Sensors The avionics suite of the MiG-41 is expected to be cutting edge, designed to give pilots unparalleled situational awareness. An advanced active electronically scanned array, AEOS A radar, will likely allow the detection of stealth targets and hypersonic weapons at great distances. Multi-spectral sensors, infrared tracking systems, and advanced electronic warfare equipment will enhance its ability to detect, track, and neutralize threats in highly contested environments. Data link technology ensures the MiG-41 can operate as part of a network force, sharing real-time information with other aircraft, satellites, and ground command centers. This makes it not just an interceptor, but also a key node in Russia's integrated defense network, weapons and armament. The weapons package of the MiG-41 is as ambitious as its performance goals. Designed primarily as an interceptor, 
The jet is expected to carry long-range air-to-air missiles capable of striking targets hundreds of kilometers away. Among these is the much-discussed R-37M long-range missile and potentially new hypersonic air-to-air -air weapons designed specifically for this aircraft. Some reports even suggest the possibility of a space defense role, with the MiG-41 being equipped to target low-orbit satellites using anti-satellite weapons. Additionally, it is expected to carry advanced electronic countermeasure pods and precision-guided munitions for versatility, though its primary mission will remain long-range interception. Role in intercepting hypersonic threats. One of the defining missions of the MiG-41 fighter jet is to counter hypersonic missiles, a growing threat in modern warfare. Unlike traditional interceptors, the MiG-41 is envisioned as a platform fast enough and with advanced enough sensors to engage hypersonic targets before they strike. This role would place it at the forefront of missile defense, making it not just a fighter for air superiority, but also a key shield against some of the deadliest weapons of the future. Comparison to Global Rivals Globally, the MiG-41 stands out as a unique project. While the U.S. focuses on sixth-generation programs like the NGAD, Next Generation Air Dominance Fighter, those platforms are expected to prioritize stealth and multi-role capabilities rather than hypersonic performance. In contrast, the MiG-41 specializes in speed and interception, carving out a unique role. Against aircraft like the F-22 Raptor or F-35 Lightning II, the MiG-41 would not compete in stealth, but instead in sheer speed, range, and altitude, allowing it to control airspace in ways those fighters cannot. Its specialization sets it apart as both an advantage and a limitation, depending on mission requirements. Operational Role in 2026 By 2026, the Mikoyan MiG-41 is seen as a strategic interceptor intended to complement, rather than replace, other Russian fighters, such as the Su-57. While the Su-57 fills the role of a stealthy multi-role platform, the MiG-41 is envisioned for missions requiring extreme speed and reach. It would likely be deployed in northern and eastern Russian airspace, where vast distances and potential hypersonic threats demand such capabilities. Its long-range reach allows it to defend against intruding bombers, reconnaissance aircraft, and even orbital assets, ensuring Russia retains a protective shield over its expansive territory. Strategic Importance The strategic significance of the MiG-41 lies in its deterrence value. Its very existence signals to adversaries that Russia is pursuing capabilities beyond the conventional fifth-generation paradigm. By focusing on hypersonic speed, near-space operations, and long-range interception, Russia positions the MiG-41 as both a defensive and offensive asset in global competition. The aircraft reflects a philosophy that air dominance is not only about stealth, but also about speed and altitude offering a different approach to future air combat. Challenges and Criticisms Despite its ambitious goals, the MiG-41 faces significant challenges. Developing engines capable of sustained Mach 4 plus speeds is a monumental task. Material science must keep pace with the thermal stresses of hypersonic flight. Funding and timelines are also hurdles, as Russia balances resources between the Su-57 program, drone development, and other defense priorities. Critics argue that the MiG-41 may remain more of a technological demonstrator or a prestige project than a mass-produced operational fighter. However, if successful, it could redefine the limits of manned air combat aircraft. Future Outlook The future of the MiG-41 depends on technological breakthroughs and sustained investment. If it achieves its goals, it could enter service in the 2030S as the fastest and most advanced interceptor ever built. Its pairing with unmanned drones, integration into network defense systems, and potential